What's good, YouTube? It's your girl, Brinks. And I'm coming to you guys today to let you guys know that I'm about to start. Bruh. Hold on. <laughs> So, I'm going to start Mr. London's two-week Fupa Be Gone challenge. And I know you guys probably think I'm lying because I'm sitting up here and I'm eating like practically a donut. And a camera. But I'm 100% serious. <laughs> so I'm gonna be honest with y'all um I'm definitely gonna do this challenge but I wanted to show you guys some real results because although I am plus size um I mostly eat healthy mostly eat healthy you guys just see me eating that Danish like, I have cheat days, but the thing is, like, I don't eat a lot of sweets. But, when I buy stuff like this, and it's in the house, I'm kind of stuck eating it. Like, you guys see my water. I got my hard-boiled eggs that I'm about to eat for lunch. You guys, like, I eat pretty freaking healthy. It's just when I have, like, a sweet craving or something... Or if I literally have the food in the house. So, a lot of the times I don't even buy sweets for that exact reason. Because if it's not around me, I'm not tempted to eat it. But if it's around me, I'm tempted to eat it. And that Danish looked freaking delightful, so I had to eat it. <laughs> so you guys, let's go ahead and cue that intro. And then we can go ahead and get started into this video. Okay, guys, so here is the two week plan that I am thinking about doing. So we already know that you have to do the um, Fupa Be Gone challenge for 14 days consistently to get your result. Is it 14 or 10 days? I don't know, you guys. I got to look it up. I mean, two weeks is 14 days. So I'm guessing it's 14 days. So you have to do that consistently to um get your needed results so i'm gonna do that every single day starting today and um every i'm gonna try to incorporate also walking two to three times a week as well i did get my planet fitness membership back you guys and i have not had that in like a couple of years so i'm really excited about getting back in the gym to begin with so i'm going to incorporate rate my um walking with it two or three times a week as well so if i'm not doing like my walk around the block i'm literally going to go to the gym and be on the treadmill for about 20 to 30 minutes to get some type of walk in and that's how we're going to incorporate this workout so if i do go to the gym i'm not just going to do like the um the treadmill i'm going to do other things as well um to kind of help build and strengthen other muscles other than just like getting the cardio in so that's, is that a cicada Y'all, ain't cicada supposed to be gone? Is that a cicada? <laughs> hmm. 
Bruh. I didn't even have to put the sound effect in there. I did it in my dog on self. That <laughs> is a cicada. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Why is there a cicada on my trampoline? Y'all, I am highly disturbed. I I just am that disturbed. Anyway, <laughs> anyways, you guys. So, we are going to go ahead and get started with this challenge. You guys are going to see my real results. I am beginning to get back into like cardio and everything. You guys know that I do do walking, but I honestly haven't walked in like a week and a half, y'all. But I have been keeping up with those keto meals, though. You guys have seen me posting keto meals. But still, y'all, that's bad on my part because. For one, like I usually keep that up. Like that's one of the things that I do keep consistent and I have not been consistent for a week and a half. And I think the main part is because I lost one of my Samsung earbuds and I like to tune out everything when I go walking and if I only got in one earbud while I'm walking and the other ear can hear like everything, like I don't really want to do it. I don't <laughs> anyway, that's not the point you guys. So you guys are going to see me struggle with this whole workout i'm telling you i'm gonna be stopping i'm gonna be taking breaks it's going to be hard i know this is not going to be easy it's going to be hard i'm going to struggle so much it's it's going to be so painful but i have to do this have to do this my baby um and I know I was supposed to have like a cryoscoped um, consultation. Um, I'm actually, I actually canceled that appointment. So I'm waiting to do um, one here next week. Yeah, next week. So I'm actually going to go ahead and get the package that I was thinking about getting for like the 119. Um, because they do like the whole body package and it's a special for introductory special. Um, so I'm just going to go with that. It includes the free consultation and all of that good stuff, y'all. So, you guys are going to go with me to that. We're going to see how that goes. We're going to view the results together. And that paired with, like, the ab workout and walking, it should have, like, a good, pretty good turnout. But we'll see how that goes. But let's just go ahead, you guys, and jump into this, this video, <laughs> this workout video. I know this video is probably going to be like two hours long because I'm going to be stopping. But I will promise I will speed it up, you guys. So, let's get started. Alright, y'all. I am back. We are about to get started with the Mr. London um, Fupa Be Gone Challenge in two weeks. So, first off, I just want to let y'all know that these results will be based on someone who is eating... Healthy and unhealthy. That's, that's what I do. I eat healthy and unhealthy. <laughs> I just had some cheese and bacon fries earlier, you all with, with some ranch and a cheeseburger. Yes. Yes, I did. So, <laughs> so, like I told you guys previously, I do eat healthy a lot. Um, a lot more than unhealthy. But, like when I have a craving for those loaded fries or loaded baked potato. It just has to happen. But I just want to want you guys to see right off the bat. Okay, so this is my little workout outfit that I'm going to be working in, out in today. I want to give you guys front views of a fupa. So front view. Side view. And back view. All right, so you guys see all of that in real time. So this is where we are starting off. I am going to update progress. I want to say probably every three days or so, but um, we'll just see how it goes so far. 
Um, I'll try to make a video, another video on Sunday with the workout and then kind of an update to show you guys. But we are just going to get straight into this video. I'm going to make sure that this is adjusted accordingly. All right, y'all. So let's get started. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. <laughs> just seeing like before and after photos and sending them over I already took before and after photos with my shorts completely up and then with my short shorts down showing the full belly and then I showed you guys as well so we are just going to go ahead and get into this <sighs> Whew, guys shaking out my nerves This video is 15 minutes, you guys. 15 minutes of workout. It could be bacteria. Untouchable stink. Okay. All right, warm up. So we all know if you want to get rid of that belly fat, you need to make sure your diet is on point and making sure you're doing your cardio. So what we're going to do is we're going to go through a quick warm up, but we're going to burn some fat in the process, and then we're going to scale up. But ladies, remember, you can get the free PDF down at the low and you can take it to the gym and still do a workout or you can do it at home. So let's go to the warm up. Yo, he tried to kill me in the first minute. <laughs>
<laughs> oh no 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 <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm definitely feeling it though. Jesus Christ. Almost killed me. Sweating. Uh, broke a sweat. I see y'all on day four. Oh my God. I need a shower. <laughs> 